All right, everybody, I got another unboxing here to do. Um, for anybody who watched my previous videos, known or may have seen in the background on top of my entertainment system some Bruce Lee statues. Well, I sold them on eBay um, for some silver. I wanted something that can at least increase in value and not decrease in value because pretty much with today people don't really have money anymore. I'm telling you, it's it's sad to buy stuff. Um, I, I lost dramatically amount of money on those Bruce Lee statues. I paid like 800 and something dollars for those two statues that I had back in 1991 and 1993. And I sold both of them for 250 bucks with shipping. So like I ended up getting 200, I had 800 bucks back. Started off with a thousand dollars and you know, no, nobody does anything. You know, of course the original one I destroyed a little bit, broke the pinky and put a big chip. So that lost dramatic value, if not all the value in the first one. But the second one, that was 500 bucks was in mint condition basically and that I couldn't sell those things at any damn price I just went down to 250 bucks with shipping and finally somebody bought it so it took me a while to sell it, it took me like over four months so this is what I got out of it and uh, let's just go through it I won't even bother actually I will tell you who did this since they gave me the free coin I bought this at Atmex on eBay site so let's see what I decided to get here For what I, it was a really good deal. That silver was crashing, so I said, you know what? Let's go for it. I wasn't too hyped on these. I saw a few people have this in a video, and I didn't care for it too much. But I was like, you know what? You never know. I don't have any of these collectors parts, so I decided to get it. And uh, so why not go for it? Let's see here. This was the regular Boyan coin, which I didn't even know at the time that there are two different styles of them. So I got the regular Boyan coin. All right. Not bad at all. Seems to be in pretty much in mint condition. It's not really bad. But I end up getting the, the Mount Rushmore's. I got two of them for like a, I think it was a dollar, I mean, excuse me, $125 each. So, with the shipping. So that was the regular Boyan one. I didn't realize that the other one, but the other ones were just way too expensive with the box and authenticity and all that other stuff. It, it was up there. It was a lot different in price, obviously. So I ended up getting two of them. So this is going to be this regular silver price. Instead of getting... 10 American Eagles or something like that. I got something different. Okay? And who knows? Maybe it'll go up in value, become a collector thing or something. Get a little extra more money than what it's worth. Hopefully this camera can get a good view of it. Don't know. It doesn't look too good in my uh, sights. But I'm sure you guys can pretty much really see it. Yeah, it's a pretty big quarter dollar in the back too. It's pretty kind of cool itself. And uh, so that's that. That's the unboxing. So I ended up getting two Mount Rushmores, something I didn't really care for. I, yeah, I mean, it's kind of cool looking, but I, I was definitely disappointed when I didn't see all four faces on there for the four presents. I mean, I thought it would be pretty cool if you had all four you facing right towards it like you would if you were visiting the site. I thought that would have been pretty cool. But it is something different as they're building it with the guy on the ladder and the rope chopping out. So that was kind of cool too. So... I'm pretty sure you guys got yeah, you can see that better now. But anyway, uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this little quick unboxing. And uh, at least now I got something that can at least increase in value as the Bruce Lee statues was a guaranteed automatically loss of value. And people just weren't willing to pay for stuff anymore. At least people are willing to buy silver at these prices and even in a few future prices. So at least now I have something that can go up in value and not down in value when it comes time to sell. I don't think I can go too much more than 18 something that, or 19 something that it is. But you never know. But anyway, thanks for watching the video. Uh, I'm going to do one more as a little remark back from my video that I did from uh, the truth about gold to silver ratio. I just want to clarify one thing as somebody read a big, big 
remark in there and just didn't understand what I was saying. So I just want to add a little bit more just in case for anybody else that does watch it. Thank you very much and thanks for watching.